Let's do another calculated field example in which we calculate the commission for our salespeople. Um, and so let's say um, if their sales are between $10,000 and $19,999, they get 2%. 20000 to $29,999, you get 3%, and greater than 30000 you get 4%. So our incentive here is to um, um, give our salespeople incentive to, to sell more, and we, they get a higher commission percentage. So um, let's create an if statement here. And so I'm going to create, create the if statement directly within the Excel worksheet, then copy that formula into the pivot table uh, calculated field. So we're going to do if C11 greater than 30,000. That's true. Well, we don't want to do the comma there. That's true. We want to multiply C11 times 0.04. That's false. We're going to do another if statement. If C11 is greater than 20,000. Then we'll multiply C11 by 3%. And then if that's false, we're going to do another if statement. If C11 greater than 10,000. Then we'll multiply it by 2%, C11 times 0 0.02. Close that parentheses, close that parentheses, close that parentheses. Okay. Okay, so that's our formula here, our general formula. Um, and then uh, what we can do here uh, is I'm going to put this, put this formula into um, Notepad and we know our field in the pivot table is revenue, so I'm going to go ahead and replace that C11 with revenue. It makes It's a lot easier to do it in Notepad. Okay, so that's our formula, and don't I mean you're going to be able to download this this workbook within um, our from our training site, so um, you can see the formulas and you can see everything. Okay, so now let's go ahead and put the calculated field into the pivot table. So I'm going to go to options, and we're going to call this sales commission. Xiaon. And the formula in. It was a formula that I just I just created and I basically inst I replaced the C11 with this this revenue field. That way I don't have to do any manipulation right here. Click OK if that's right. Uh, let's see, what do we do here? Let's do this. Oh, looks like I misspelled it here. Oh, it didn't paste our entire formula in. So let's let's go back. 
Um, some reason we didn't get everything, so let's copy that again. Okay, there we go. Um, all right, so that should work. Okay, so here we have um, our commission. So uh, we basically created a calculated field with the statements, and now we have our sales commission.